This is Doug Larson with The Daily BS. I got a question from somebody about beta alanine, uh, what it is and how much to take. Uh, so first off, beta alanine uh, is, a, is a supplement that people take to help kind of decrease the amount of burning they get in, in their muscles, uh, which is the easiest way to put it. Um, scientifically, um, beta alanine is the rate limiting substrate in the production of carnosine, which is an intramuscular buffer. Buffers decrease um, acidity or decrease al alkalinity and bring you back to a neutral pH. So as you're burning carbohydrates and you develop that acidity, uh, the beta alanine will make that acidity take longer to develop so you can um, kind of push through your workout and work at a higher intensity for longer before you get tired, you get that muscle burn and then you go to failure and you can't do any more reps. So um, you can buy beta alanine for pretty cheap, you know, you can probably get for 30 bucks, you can probably get, you know, three possibly three months worth or so, depending on how much you buy and who you buy it from. And you're gonna to wanna to take, if you're a guy, probably around you know, five or six grams per day. Uh, I would recommend starting off with two grams before your workout and then maybe two grams after your workout. Uh, you're gonna get a little bit of a tingling sensation probably you know, at the end of your extremities, like in your hands. Um, you can get it really anywhere, but uh, you get a little bit of a tingle when you first start using it. Uh, just. You know, I think it's just, I never, I've really looked up exactly why that's happening, but I'm, I would assume it's some type of a, uh, of a, a blood vessel uh, vasodilation or something like that. And it kind of feels like your hands uh, fell asleep and you get that little tingly feeling. So uh, it's not going to hurt you in any way. Uh, at least no research has shown that it hurts you uh, up to this point. Uh, so don't quote me on this if it's 20 years later and we figure out that that's going to kill you. Uh, but it should be just fine for you. So um, two grams before you work out, two grams after you work out, ladies can probably start with half of that. And then after you get used to that little bit of a tingle, um, you can bump it up a little bit. And guys, I would move on to three grams before and three grams afterward. And then ladies can uh, move up to two grams before and two grams afterward. Uh, it'll take a while for that to build up in your system. Uh, I think the last bit of research that I looked at on that showed that after five weeks, you were, you know, you, you were like, I want to say it was like 40% saturated, and then after 10 weeks you were you were like 80% saturated, and then you know after that you're pretty much 100% saturated. So it takes a while for it to build up in your system. Uh, so if you miss a dose, you know it's not just gonna it's not gonna all be depleted and all be gone. If you miss a dose one day, no big deal. Just jump back on it um, the next day. But you want to be obviously as consistent as you can. So uh, a little bit about beta alanine. If you have any more questions about that, just drop us a line. Uh, on fitter.tv under the ask a question tab.